last year's winner was Russia's Dima Belan. Despite arguments about block votes, he did have a great song, great gimmick, and a great performance. Yes, I get something to It turns out Dima's in town. So Andrew has sent me on a reconnaissance mission. As luck would have it, Dima is filming a video here in London. So I may discover the secret of Russia's success behind these doors. <laughs> Whoa, come on. When you got home from Serbia, what was the mood like in Russia? Oh my God, uh, Eurovision in Russia, like uh, Olympic game, like big event. National event. Nobody slept, slept on the nights uh, of Eurovision. Night of Eurovision. <laughs> When Dima won the contest, even Prime Minister Putin got in touch. Putin sent telegram. It's nice. <laughs> it's nice. And it's, uh, for me, it's uh, very important, you know. Yeah. Praise indeed. Can't imagine Gordon Brown doing that. And Dima gave me a bit of advice. You need to uh, take beautiful artists, bring to your revision. Maybe you just take it a little bit more serious this time. Well, we are. We're taking it very seriously this time. Come to Moscow in this year. I I'd love to come to Moscow in this year. You will, you will see. Yeah. You need to come to Moscow. The Russians had better watch out, because this year we really are stepping up our game. As well as a lord, we have a record company powerhouse behind us. Having met last year's winner, Dima, I have a plan. Andrew, I've got some news. How grave is it? Well, now, I met Dima, the winner of the Eurovision last oh. year. Uh, the Prime Minister of Russia sent him a telegram of congratulations. Obviously, they're the hosts. They're taking it very, very seriously. I really do believe you should go to Russia. We have three reasons to go to Russia. One, check out the venue. Two, meet the fans. And three, persuade the incredibly scary Prime Minister Putin to give us the Russian vote. Well, two out of three won't be bad. Andrew has a good strike rate when it comes to securing votes. And before he leaves the country, he has one more person in his sights. It's my mate Dima, who could be a powerful ally. Can you do us a favour? When you meet people, can you get the message out that Britain, we are taking your vision very seriously. We are very year. serious this year. Very yeah. serious. I mean, very, very serious. Good. Yeah. Since Russia can't vote, you see, because it can't vote for itself, if you could just tell everybody, just vote for Britain, whatever happens. Maybe I work. Uh, uh, not dating. He's working on it. I work now. on it yeah. now. Would you come on my Eurovision program with Graham? If uh, you could tell your fans to vote for us. I have many fans. Many fans. Yes, well, we need them. That's a deal. Yay, Dima. <laughs> <laughs>